Give it up for SLK. Amen. Wow, wow. Look at you. Please be seated. Uh, you're just looking at me. Look at you. Ladies and gentlemen, please celebrate the Reverend Biodo Fatoibo. You're welcome, sir. Ah, it's a good sign. Huh? Look at you. Pastor, you know me. I came with a joke for you. <laughs> please sit down, please. Koza at 18, 1999. Huh? 1999, I was in um, year four. Primary school, year four, primary school. Day. <laughs> well, I, I've heard Pastor several times. He, he has been talking about how the church started from a lorry. He talks about a lorry a lot. I listen to Pastor a lot. Don't mind me. Because I read you, I'm always locked on. <laughs> As in, that's been a blessing to me personally. And I hear Pastor talk about a lorry. Like, I, I didn't believe it until I went there and saw myself. Pastor. God was faithful. Ilori. You know, let me tell you what, it's only in Lagos that you see um, white men come to Lagos and chop up. White men come to Abuja, chop up. When I went to Ilori, I didn't see a fat Oimbo, <laughs> apart from Pastor. <laughs> fat Oimbo. <laughs> fat Oimbo. <laughs> I knew you would get that late. I knew it. <laughs> I knew you would get that late. I was waiting. <laughs> ah, my God. But then, I mean, God has been faithful. I like Koza a lot. I, I know how you appreciate comedians. Uh, um, I'm speaking for the comedians now. I know how you appreciate comedians. I just want to say God bless you. So on behalf of all the comedians, please a round of applause for yourselves. It shows you people know that um, comedy is one of the most difficult things to do, actually. You must have experienced it before. Have you ever cracked a joke that returned to you void before? Like, <laughs> as in, the joke did not fulfill the purpose for which it was sent. So, uh, <laughs> and it happens a lot. No jokes. Maybe you are just in your friend, something that happened earlier today. In your mind, that's in funny, dad. In your mind. But you are not telling her, you are telling her like, so, the guy now went, the, the, you know, maybe in your mind, the funniest part was this one. And now jump inside the gutter. Then your friend is still like, the funny part. <laughs> then you now start lying. And she now died. And, um... <laughs> but comedy, the thing about laughter is that laughter is good for the body, yeah? But you know that we, we sometimes have no choice but to give complimentary laugh, even if it's not from our hearts. It has happened to everybody. If, if your spouse takes you out, I mean the man now, let me use Pastor Flo as an example. Sir, if you take your wife out, take her to the expensive, most expensive place, you know anything you say at that point will be funny. <laughs> the, um, I just want to go and use the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> you want to use the toilet? Even men, not only ladies, men, we have our fake laugh in our hearts too. Sometimes it has happened before where you go to uh, maybe towards the end of the month, exactly. Your boss at work cracks a joke towards the end of the month. You won't laugh. Why? <laughs> you, whether it's funny or it's not funny. <laughs> now, this is how you know a fake laugh from a genuine laugh. I'll, give you, I'll teach you so that you know when they are faking laugh for you. Very, no, I'm serious. Very single guys, note this. If a girl, if a guy, let me start with the guys. If a guy laughs a fake laugh for you, watch out for the end. It's always at the end. They drag the end. You've not seen. My boy, you funny going on. It's a lie. It's a big lie. But the ladies are more wicked. Ladies, when they laugh, they rest at the end for you to know they went through stress. So you go, <laughs> hmm. you are in trouble. I don't have much time. I, I have a lot to say, actually. The, the, the thing is, it's no coincidence that Koza, 
because I showed me love today, Val's Day felt like, ah, oh. so I said, oh. <laughs> but you know the thing about, I want, to, I want to talk to the single guys. Do we have single guys here? Do we still have single guys here? Because I see a lot of beautiful ladies in Koza. I don't know if there's single guys here. If you're still single, shout out, woo. <laughs> single guys, let me teach you something. There's this thing that guys do that girls have sent me to you to tell you, to warn you that you should stop. You know the issue with guys is that, not that we don't know when we, when we see the sister, we know. We know that she's spirit-filled, but you don't know how to start the conversation. You're just meeting her for the first time. There's this one that our fathers used. They call it pick-up line. There's this pick-up line our fathers used that some men are still using in 2017. This one, this particular one. Ladies, we, you bear me witness. They said I should tell you that you should stop. It's old, it's hackneyed. Change it. This particular one. Don't, don't let me use this pastor's wife. No. <laughs> Sister, I think I've met you before. <laughs> You're a Christian. You know it's a lie. <laughs> Why I know? I tried it last week. It didn't work. I went to meet her. I said, um, sorry, I think I've met you before. I didn't know she had my time. She said, where? You know, normally ladies just slide past. She said, where? I said, relax, we're not fighting. You know, just, it's a peaceful. I said, uh, I said, so that I will save my face, I started mentioning names of places that we might have met. I said, um, do you attend Koza? Koza? No. Okay, I mentioned no of my uni. I said, did, did you attend Covenant University at any point in your life? No. I said, going down. Maybe you attended Dance High school, my secondary school. No, I went down. Did you attend Carol Nursery and Primary School? No. When I saw that she wanted to fold my hand, I said, "Sharp your rubber boy." I changed the pattern of the question. Amen. I said, "Baby, which hospital were you born?" She said, "General Hospital." I said, "I remember. I was the baby just beside you." Can't. But, but you know the thing about. But I trust Koza men. Koza men are not like that. We have the best lines, Abi. Koza men. Am I speaking the truth? If a Koza guy, typical Koza guy, sees a sister after service, the fellowship after service, <laughs> like Pastor Wale just mentioned, maybe she's with her friends, just talking about how the service was, how awesome the service was. You know, you, you need to separate her, Abi, so that you can talk. Koza guy will just walk. Hello, sister, I celebrate you. Please, I do not want to leave you as a face in the crowd. I would like you to pack what you came to church with your Bible, your iPad. Just step forward. I said, when I saw you, when I saw you, not only was my body excited, my spirit was excited, my soul was excited. So much so, we have a question for you. And the question is, because I've been all over the city of Abuja for so long. I have only one minute left. But there's, there's this thing I, I did in Koza, Lagos, and I want to do it here. Um, it's been 18 years. I remember then, a lot of things have changed. You agree with me? A lot of things have improved over time. One of the things that I know has improved, the movies we watched growing up. You remember? How many of you remember this soundtrack? You must complete it. In this life. But you know, it's not only the mainstream, people like us, we didn't, we didn't grow up watching that kind of thing. I grew up in a very Christian home. So I didn't watch mainstream Nollywood. But the people I watch, the Christian movies I watch, they've also improved. Then, how many of you know them? If, you might not know their real name, but you remember Aya. That thing scared me. That thing scared me. That means you didn't grow up in a Christian home. The title must minister to you. The ultimate power. The beginning and the end. Captives of the might. Any title that you can do mm, at the end is a Messiah title. The gods are dead. It's only in mainstream Nollywood that you see that they shout at you in the advert. Take the Lord out here. Oh, did that do with you? No, 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 no. Very calm. Captives, advert. Captives of the mighty. See them. They shall be rescued. 
Um, the Daily Vibe, Captain of the Mighty, a film produced and directed by Mike Bamiloye, starring Doni Hassan, Gloria Bamiloye, Israel Oriya Dewey, Captain of the Mighty, Mighty, Mighty. Holy God, Holy God, Holy God, Holy God. Can break, can break, can break. The Captain, Captain of the Mighty, 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 Mighty. I don't know. Have you noticed that then they used to? Who told them that witches laugh three times? <laughs> Everything must be three times. <laughs> Who told them that that time we used to believe that God's voice must echo? I don't know where we got that idea from. Maybe they got it from the part of the Bible that says, Once have I spoken, twice have you heard. And you just see, and, and it's only in your movie that the wife will be calling her husband, wife, who? her husband, brother Daniel. Then the husband will reply, Sister Shadi. Then, have you noticed? Let me, I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Towards the end, at the end of the movie, let's paint a particular, a typical Monsignor film. The guy had messed, messed up throughout the movie. He now wants to beg for forgiveness. We we'll just come. Sister Shadi, his wife. Sister Shadi, please forgive. Don't forget everything was with three times. Please forgive me, Sister Shadi. Forgive. Forgive? Did he just say forgive? After all you did for me? <laughs> now, the movie has to end. The only way they can end the movie is God. God has to settle the fight. We just come from nowhere. Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi. Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi. Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi, Sister Shadi. Forgive him, forgive him, forgive him, forgive him. After all, after all, after all, after all. I forgive you, I forgive you, I forgive you, I forgive you. The sister Shade will now go, but because of God, I forgive you. Then they will now, who said kiss? You want to kiss Daniel? How? Even when they want to hug, they will press pause to God. Be the glory. Happy birthday, Koza. Thank you very much for having me. God bless you. Thank you very much. God bless you, sir. Give it up for SLK. Hallelujah. Koza is 18 today.